uh, we, we made a book uh, basically to have a communication tool, which we lacked before, uh, which, is, uh, which is connecting the analog world together with the digital world, and where we wanted to have a communication tool between patient, dentists, and dentists and labs to get the whole picture together. So together with the book, we can now actually get what we see in the book. So we can, uh, the patient can choose from the book like a menu, and then we can go to the tree shape dental software and uh, get those teeth and uh, show the patient how it looks together. So this is the book, Fabulous Smiles. So it starts with part one. That's called Identify. Here we have uh, three categories of age. So we have youthful, adult, mature. They can just uh, have a feeling of what they like. Uh, also important is that they can also show what they don't like because that's also something very important to know because some patient can see I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this, but I like this. So, uh, so it's, uh, it's very important to find a common denominator for it. And all smiles are natural smiles, so they're uh, asymmetric, just like n nature intended them to be. And uh, with this, it also looks uh, much more natural than symmetric smiles normally does. And uh, then we have part two. So this is called Customize. And this is more based on the communication between the clinic and the technician. We have a close-up for uh, every smile. And uh, you can see the surface structure and texture and translucency on all the teeth as well. So there are a lot of different uh, kind of shapes and a lot of different kind of teeth and uh, translucencies and colorations, etc. So you can get inspired of as a dental technician. But also you can discuss this with very picky patients, for instance, who wants, oh, I want a little bit bluish, but not too much. And then you can go in and, okay, this patient maybe has the translucency you want, but you like the teeth from another patient. At last, we have part three. It's called artistry. So here's, for instance, Olivia, and we made a temporary bridge. And, uh, to, and also uh, we show how to stain it. So you can get the same result as the picture of the temporary bridge that we made for Olivia, which uh, corresponds to how her smile looks like in uh, real life. Uh, the communication between lab and the uh, clinic is improved uh, when using this book because you see the same picture. So you, you know what the patient likes and you can, uh, as a doctor, you can uh, actually tell the, uh, tell the uh, lab, please choose, uh, for instance, Fab 110. This is what the patient likes, but he only likes the right side, for instance, or the left side, or he likes the smile just as it is. Uh, we use the trios uh, and scan all the patients to get the uh, uh, libraries into the dental system. So when we got the scans, we sectioned them and uh, uh, made a really, really hard job on them because we uh, sculpted them so they looked like real teeth, uh, especially approximal and cervical. Uh, and then we also worked a lot with occlusion to have the occlusion uh, in a really nice setup. So, so it's a perfect occlusion on the libraries. Uh, if you're a lab and you want to use this book, uh, the, the best way to use this book is if your doctor also has a book. So uh, promote the book to the doctor and then you can uh, start communicating with the same pictures and on the same slides. And uh, you know if the doctor wants uh, how much translucency he wants, what kind of mammalons he wants, etc. But uh, you can also use it for uh, self-education by looking at, at really nice teeth and uh, see how you can make a nice texture and nice uh, shading, etc. The libraries in dental system are downloadable from either the control center in uh, the control panel. So you can uh, choose to look for smile libraries and check which one you want. If you want the fabulous smile libraries for uh, Crown & Bridge or the dentures. Or when you're installing the 2019 version of the dental system, uh, you can also choose to download them uh, by the end of the uh, installation. Uh, we brought some cases with us. So we're going to show how to use the book together with the smile design software and also the tree shape dental design software.